Narcissistic abuse is a term used to describe the harm caused by someone who has a narcissistic personality. A person with narcissistic personality disorder or NPD for short has an excessive need for attention and admiration. They lack empathy and they believe they are very important. They often hurt others to get what they want. Understanding how this abuse affects people is important for helping them heal. Narcissistic abuse involves several harmful behaviors. Some common ones are gaslighting. This is when the abuser makes the victim question their own reality. The victim starts to doubt their own memories and feelings. Emotional blackmail. This is when the abuser threatens to cause emotional harm if the victim doesn't do what they want. Isolation. The abuser tries to cut the victims off from friends and family, making them more dependent on the abuser. Narcissistic abuse can deeply hurt a person's emotions. Some common emotional effects are anxiety and constant worry. Victims often feel anxious and on edge because they are always afraid of upsetting the abuser. This constant fear can lead to stress and other health problems. Depression. Over time, victims may feel hopeless and worthless. The constant criticism from the abuser can make them feel bad about themselves and lead to depression. Anger and frustration. Victims may feel very angry at the abuser, but this anger can be mixed with guilt or confusion. They might feel like they can never express their feelings properly. Narcissistic abuse can affect how victims think about themselves and their relationships. Distorted self-image Victims may start to see themselves in a negative light because of the abuser's constant put-downs. They might struggle with knowing who they really are or what they want. Difficulty trusting others. After being hurt by the abuser, victims may find it hard to trust other people. They might be alert of getting close to others, fearing they will be hurt again. Post-traumatic stress disorder or PTSD for short. Some victims develop PTSD, which can cause nightmares, flashbacks and severe anxiety. The ongoing trauma from the abuse can lead to long-term mental health problems. The abuse can also impact a victim's social life and relationships. Isolation. The abuser may cut off the victims from friends and family, making them feel alone and dependent on the abuser. Strain on relationships. Victims might have trouble maintaining relationships because of the emotional damage from the abuse. They may struggle with setting boundaries and communicating effectively. Social withdrawal. Victims might withdraw from social activities because they feel overwhelmed or unworthy. This can lead to increased loneliness. Narcissistic abuse can affect how victims think and solve problems too. Confusion and self-doubt. Victims may become confused and doubt their own thoughts and memories because of gaslighting. This can make decision-making and problem-solving difficult for them too. They might have difficulty concentrating. Stress and anxiety from the abuse can make it hard to focus and remember things. Negative thought patterns. Victims might develop a negative outlook on life feeling like they are always failing or that they are not good enough. The stress from narcissistic abuse can also affect a person's physical health. Chronic stress and illness. Ongoing stress from abuse can lead to physical health problems like high blood pressure, digestive issues and chronic pain. Stress weakens the immune system making people more likely to get sick. Sleep problems. Victims often have trouble sleeping, which can worsen their mental and physical health. Physical exhaustion. 
The emotional strain can make victims feel very tired and drained, impacting their ability to carry out everyday activities. Recovering from narcissistic abuse is challenging but possible. Here are some important steps for healing. Therapy. Professional therapy can help victims process their trauma and develop coping strategies. Therapists can also assist in rebuilding self-esteem. Talking about rebuilding self-esteem, victims need to work on rebuilding their self-worth by challenging negative thoughts and setting healthy boundaries. Reconnecting with support systems. It's important for victims to reconnect with friends, family and support groups. Having a strong support network can aid in the healing process. Self-care. Engaging in self-care activities like exercising, eating well and pursuing hobbies is crucial for physical and emotional recovery. Narcissistic abuse has deep and far-reaching effects on people. It impacts them emotionally, psychologically, socially and physically. Victims often face emotional pain, distorted self-perception, strained relationships and health problems. However, with time, support and professional help, recovery is possible. Understanding these effects, help in providing better support to those affected and guiding them toward a healthier and happier life.